All right, hang with me for just a moment. Uh, why did I look up Alistair Crowley this morning or Crowley? Because um, he is the one that it was quoted saying, um, do what thou wilt and let that be the whole of the law. I believe I uh, quoted that properly. And um, so when people say things, we should look at who they are. And Alistair Crowley was an English occultist ceremonial magician, poet, painter, novelist, and mount mountaineer. He founded the religion Thelema. Do we even know what that is? Identifying himself as the prophet entrusted with guiding humanity into the eon of Horus in the early 20th century. Now, again, who is Horus? Okay, Horus is an Egyptian god. And so this is a man who is saying he's going to guide humanity into uh, an, an eon of, you know, prosperity and, and things of that nature. Um, or I can assume Horus would be of those things. Uh, but either way, date of birth, 10, 12, 19, uh, excuse me, 1875. And his death on December the 1st, 1947, he's dying of, uh, died of bronchitis. Um, and so, if it, again, the field of work is, a cult, work of, is occultism. Now, again, just bear with me for one more second, because now we got to find out what is occultism. It is the uh, uh, supernatural, a category of supernatural beliefs and practices, which generally fall outside the scope of religion and science. Now, Again, I'm not going to read all that again. All I want to I want to drop down to this last part that says uh, the term occult sciences was used in the 16th century. Uh, 16th century Europe to refer to astrology, alchemy and natural magic, which today are considered pseudosciences. So we are uh, still repeating someone's uh, words that the whole of the law should be do whatever you want to do. And that was going to lead us or lead humanity into an eon of Horus. Either we need to find out uh, if the eon of Horus is truly for humanity. And then we need to find out what Thelema is as a religion. And then uh, we need to consider, if we're considering this a pseudoscience, then why aren't we considering Aleister Crowley a pseudo uh, authority to, to tell us that we should just be living the whole of the law, no, or the um, let that be the whole of the law, whatever we think we should be doing. Maybe this is why we have such an imbalance because we have people that are trying to obey the law and then another law, and then we have people that believe whatever they want to do is all that they have to do. If this resonates with you, I would invite you, I am inviting you to give, donate, dollar sign, go ask Val is my cash app. I appreciate it very much. Please forward, subscribe, comment. Let's get um, a conversation going because I'm done and I'm tired of people living by a different law and set of code of ethics. Um, that is bothering, that is frustrating the African-American, the black American, the Negro, the colored, the brown people, and even some of the uh, white people. So just know that this is out here and we will not perish for the lack of knowledge. We have the knowledge right here.